Romans chapter 10, verse 14. Can you put that up quickly? Romans 10, 14. And how shall they call on him in whom they have not believed? And how shall they believe in whom they have not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher? So it's hearing is the channel by which people connect with God. They have to hear the gospel. They have to hear the truth of the word of God for them to connect with the God of the truth. But I want to make a note of caution here. We can hear the truth, but choose not to believe or accept it. You can hear the truth and choose that you will not believe it or you will not accept it. A, one of our, some young man that attends one other parish got married and, and so invited us for the wedding. And I went for the wedding somewhere in Ikeja, one funny place, somewhere in Jerry Ikeja. And when we got there, you know, as soon as I entered the building where the service was to take place, I was afraid. Even just the arrangement of the temple was a bit funny. Then they started the service and they were reading from all sorts of scriptures and saying some funny things. And I was worried for him. That, ah, what kind of wedding ceremony is this? In the end, that marriage collapsed. Within three years, marriage was dead. The girl's mother came to carry the girl out of his house herself. So later on, I was exploring with him. And I said, didn't you somehow get an indication that this pathway was, was the wrong one? He said, Pastor, you know, I was hearing, but I just didn't want to accept it. So he knew that this girl was from a strange background, and he still went ahead. No wonder in Philippians chapter 4, verse 8, Apostle Paul, in, in, in giving a prescription, he gives a, he gives a prescriptive list of things that we need to think about. And the first thing that he puts on that list, he says, finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true. That's the first thing we should think about. Think on these things. Whatsoever is true. That's what you should, you know, you need to be thinking the truth. Praise the Lord. 